Hi everybody. So today I'm going to show you how you can scan your own home network and find out all of the devices connected to it. You can do that in just a few seconds and you can use a completely free piece of software. So first thing you want to do is open a browser. I'm just using Chrome and head over to this website, advancedipscanner.com. I've been using this for quite a while. The reason I like it um, is it's got a few great features. So super easy to use. So you can see what's on your network. It's going to detect the MAC address. It's also going to detect the IP address. You can also export scan results if you want to. And most importantly, there's no installation required. So first thing you want to do is hit the free download button here. Once you're in your downloads folder, you'll see the advanced IP scanner executable. So if you just double click on that, select the language version for you. And then here's the two options. You can install it, but also you can run this as a portable version where there's no installation on your machine required. So if you just click on run the portable version and hit run, that's going to download a few files, extract them, and just run uh, the software without installing it on your PC. Once it's open, uh, just check in the URL. It's scanning your network. So here, mine's 192.168.1.1, and it's going up to 254. So it'll do all the IP addresses in that range. If it's not entered, you can enter it manually or just hit this blue IP button here and the C1, and it'll self-populate, and then just hit scan. Okay, so once the scan's completed, you can see it populates the table. On the left-hand column, you can see the status of the connection. So blue means that device is currently active on your network. Then you've got a device name, and then more importantly, you've got the IP address here. You've also got the manufacturer, uh, if that's uh, displayed by the device. So you can see a few devices I've got here, and also the MAC address. So really simple to use, super fast. You don't need to install it on your machine, and you're going to find out who's connected to your network. Hope you found it helpful. If you did, please consider subscribing and maybe even hitting that notification bell so we see each other in the next video. Take care, everybody.